three feet. Clean it out a little bit more just to make sure. seven feet to the ground from there. Alright, so there's how that looks once I'm done and that's nothing but dirt shoved back in there and it'll eventually erode down in there to fill that gap up. It goes down three feet anyway, so it's not going anywhere. We can thank old uh, Ma Bell for this pole. They cut this down, well I cut this down years ago. This is an old abandoned telephone pole that they'd left out in the yard used to service. Evidently there was a, a rodeo rider that used to live out in this backyard in this little bitty house that I've since torn down and uh, he used to practice his rodeo routine out here in this backyard and um, you know he just lived in that little house and that's all he did and this was his telephone pole and uh, I cut it in half so this is uh, 10 feet of pole three feet in the ground, seven feet above. So I can uh, attach some uh, metal to the tops of these as I need fit to make them taller. But this way, as I'm mowing, 
You know, if I brush up against these with a lawnmower, it's not gonna, it's not gonna move them. Um, they'll be just fine. And they should, uh, even as old as they are, they should last my lifetime anyway, unless you know they actually get broke by uh, high winds or something. But man, that'd be something. Anyway, there's that. Right, there you have it. Just uh, seven feet, a little bit over. You see it's old, it's got its problems, but like I said, all this needs to do is uh, hold up a net. Good, underneath, solid. And that'll get me started. And no, I did not do all these just now. I did those two last night, and then that one, and this one just now. So, this should give you a little bit better idea about the size of it. Now, just to picture those uh, posts being a little bit taller, maybe two feet taller with uh, maybe some unistrut and then the, the nets hanging from the outside all the way around it. Now to give you an idea what was going on. All right, there you go. That's what I've got left over after digging four, three feet by, those holes were approximately nine inches, maybe a little bit smaller, maybe a little bit bigger. Because those jaws on that post hole digger, they move in and out a little bit, but uh, eight inches minimum. So after planting those four poles, that's what I've got left. And uh, I want to try to reclaim as much of it as I can. I don't really have anywhere else to put it right now. so putting on this cardboard will let me get most of it back anyway. I'll lose a little but uh, man there's a lot of clay in this so I'm going to have to mend this. Um, but I've got the compost to do it so alright man it's been a lot of work and uh, I don't like digging post holes so I'm glad that's over with. Woo! Anyway, you're growing hope you're kicking ass for not growing hope you start soon. Cheers people. Later!